But does wearing a mask really work? Eight on your side continues our team coverage this morning as local officials scramble to figure out how to slow the spread of COVID-19. Eight on your side's Dan Roberts live in the studio breaking down all the latest science. Good morning. Good morning to you both. Research shows wearing a face covering may slow the spread of coronavirus. Go ahead, take a look at your screens. At the University of Illinois, scientists are using a device that simulates a person with COVID-19 coughing. It tests how various household fabrics perform as masks. Scientists found two layers and three layers of t-shirt fabric are highly effective at blocking droplets when you cough, sneeze, or talk. Now, overseas in Scotland, researchers tested masks on a mannequin connected to a cough simulating machine. These images show the airflow when someone breathes without a mask versus this image of when someone has a mask on. Researchers found masks help limit the spread of droplets if they are put on correctly. And some of these masks, the ones that weren't tightly fitting around the mouth, there was a backward jet. And these can actually, um, we have to be really careful when we're not wearing properly fitted masks. And there's also a study by Health Affairs that found mandatory mask wearings in 15 states and Washington, D.C., possibly averted up to 450,000 COVID cases over the course of nearly eight weeks. So, Melissa, some astonishing research there. Yeah, those numbers. And, Deanne, I understand some Florida researchers are also studying masks and how they can prevent the spread of the virus. Yeah, absolutely. Engineers at Florida, Atlant Florida Atlantic University are studying how far the droplets actually go once you sneeze. And their research actually found out that droplets can spread between 9 and 12 feet, which goes beyond that recommended six-foot social distancing measure. Those engineers say six foot is the minimum, but if you can do more, of course, that is better. Very interesting. Thank you, Deanne. Mm -hmm.